Tens of thousands of dollars spent on catering and pricey meals out, not to mention millions paid the teachers above and beyond their salaries. Fox 29 investigative reporter Jeff Cole looks at just what the struggling Trenton School District is paying for. About 12,000 students attend the struggling Trenton public school system. Trenton spends about $20,000 yearly per student. That's on average two grand more than nearly all other districts. Yet the graduation rate for its high schools is just over 48%, the worst in New Jersey. And many of its students fail to meet proficiency targets in core subjects like language and math. So why did the district in January, March, and again in April of 2012 spend hundreds of dollars in grant money at the Build-A-Bear workshop? Trenton school administrators would not answer our questions on camera. In fact, they wouldn't answer our questions at all. They simply wrote general descriptions like this one about Build-A-Bear. It allowed early childhood students to explore winter hibernating among bears, as well as physical characteristics. Three times in 2012, over 2,000 tax dollars were spent to take students to the themed restaurant Medieval Times. Trenton wrote the trips would augment the study of the Middle Ages. We feel like there has not been enough scrutiny on where taxpayer dollars are going. Kyle Olson is the founder of Education Action Group, EAG, a Michigan-based nonprofit which says it's nonpartisan and focused on education reform. Olson's group obtained Trenton's spending records under New Jersey's Open Records Act and gave them to Fox 29. While EAG's critics argue the nonprofit, funded with millions from unnamed donors, is anti-union, Olson says the group's focus is improving schools and accountability. When you have um, huge amounts of students who are not proficient in reading and math, that's your primary mission. You're fa failing in that mission. That should be taken care of first. Records show Trenton spent a half million dollars in legal fees in the 2011-2012 school year for what it said were general legal matters. Camden, another struggling district, spent nearly twice that. The documents show well over $47,000, nearly all of it in grant funds, were spent on catering for parents' nights and award ceremonies. But that spending pales in comparison. To the stunning amounts of tax dollars, the district is shelling out to workers for unused sick time. 2.7 million bucks in the 2011-2012 school year. And there's more. According to the records, its 837 teachers took 9,000 sick days in that same year. Again, Trenton's top school administrators would not answer questions about this spending. Kyle Olson of EAG. What should be happening is making sure that kids can read, making sure that they can compute, making sure that they are prepared for life, whether it's a career, whether it's higher education or the military or whatever it may be. That's what they should be taking care of first. A school official in charge of curriculum did take a look at the figures and wrote she had no knowledge of spending in the 2011-2012 school year. However, she added, all spending is to be connected to curriculum and to support student learning. Jeff Cole, Fox 29 News.